We live in a society where there are a million meal plans at our access. At this instant, I can just go like hashtag fitness on Instagram and find a meal plan and follow it. And the same with workout guides. I can just go find some fitness person on Instagram and buy a workout plan. Yet we are as confused as ever when it comes to food and fitness and our bodies. Why though? We're given hundreds of guides. like for like free or for 10 bucks or for five bucks or for 50 bucks or for I don't know how much. But we're so confused about food. We are so confused about working out literally. We have no idea what our body is telling us. We have no idea what we should be doing. We're just on Instagram trying to find answers. Well, I'm sorry, but your answer is not on Instagram. Your answer is right here. It's inside of you. We have lost touch with living intuitively, with eating intuitively, and with moving intuitively. You know, remember when you were like a kid and you're like, mom, I'm hungry, feed me, and you're like, okay, now I've had enough, I'll eat later? No, now we obsess over whether we're hungry or not because if we eat that one piece of bread, it is detrimental to the way we look and therefore we regret it and we sit in our rooms and we cry. And this is not an exaggeration. This is real life. People are developing eating disorders, unhealthy relationships with their food, with their bodies, and with fitness because of all these crazy messages that are being sent and sold to us through social media. So I say goodbye diet culture, goodbye workout plans, goodbye meal plans that are selling some kind of thing that if you lose 10 pounds, it'll make you happy. I'm telling you this, if I make and I will be making a beginner guide to lifting, I'm not giving you any promises because the promises is in the work you do. If you follow the guide and you follow your body and you eat well and you train well, you're going to see results. But I'm not going to say that if your body changes, you're going to reach the ultimate happiness like all these other guides claim. Because you know, all, they all claim that and you're finding yourself sadder and sadder and more unhappier with your body than ever. So goodbye diet culture, goodbye meal plans. Let's start listening to our bodies and that's when the real magic is going to happen.